teachers in seven Florida school districts will soon be locked and loaded. A new law enacted this month in the state gives schools the option to allow teachers to carry concealed guns. The law expands on the Guardian School Safety Program introduced after the Parkland shooting last year. That initial program was everybody except classroom teachers. Okeechobee is one of seven school districts taking advantage of the new option to arm teachers. The assistant superintendent of Okeechobee County says their first priority is protecting students. You can't have a hashtag of putting students first and not want to use every opportunity to keep them safe. Tedder says they already have several volunteers. One teacher who wished to remain anonymous due to safety concerns says they are ready for the responsibility. 20 years as a teacher. You know, you, you know your kids, you would want to see anything bad happen to any of them. You have to be ready and prepared if the, something happens. You have to be willing to do what needs to be done. But gun control groups dispute the law, arguing teachers simply can't fill the role of law enforcement. We're worried about the accuracy of that teacher being able to shoot or to be able to shoot at all in that type of high intense adrenaline type of situation. Beyond Florida, at least eight other states like Texas and Louisiana allow teachers and staff to be armed. Some parents who have kids enrolled in the district think it's a good idea. They say the new law will eliminate schools as soft targets. If all else fails and my child is sitting in a classroom with some psycho coming through that door, I want my child behind that teacher and I want that teacher equipped to do something to help themselves which is also going to help my child. School employees and teachers who volunteer to pack heat have a long list of requirements, including passing drug tests, psychological exams, and over 100 hours of training. In Okeechobee, Florida, Alina Shirazi, Fox 